Hello and welcome to the devotion for Wednesday, June the 12th, entitled Measure Up. Now, Sunday mornings we talked about investing, investing our time, investing our life, our mission, our goals, our money, everything that we have. We make investments into the future. We make investments into people. And the question is, how much do we want to invest? What do we want to invest? And what kind of a return are we going to get on our investments? I have found that investing in people, investing in my children, investing in my marriage, when it comes down to those vital relationships in my life, I can never invest too much. And yet, part of our human nature is to be very stingy about what we invest and to hoard and to uh, be self-centered. And yet, as we look at 2 Corinthians 9, 6, it says, Remember this, whoever sows sparingly will also reap sparingly. But whoever sows generously will also reap generously. So wise people who want to have generous uh, rewards for their time, for their uh, relationships, need to sow generously. Also in Luke 6.38, Jesus says, Give, and it will be given to you. A good measure, pressed down, shaken together, and running over, will be poured back into your lap. Because with the measure you use, it will be measured back to you. So when I say measure up, how much do we want to give? Because it is going to affect the return that we have back. Now, we can't give simply because we're hedonistic and we're masking it. We're giving because we want to get more. We give because we want the reward to be huge, beneficial, life-changing. And we know that great things never happen from meager beginnings, from chintzy or stingy uh, offerings, whether we're giving up of our time or our attention, if we give the leftovers, if we give uh, the, uh, the bare minimum, half of our attention to anything, it will never truly grow and bring back the benefit that could have been there if we truly measure up, if we really do things with, as scripture says, all of our heart, all of our soul, all of our mind, and all of our strength. I want to measure up. Let's pray. Father, Lord, as we think about that whole investment uh, and return, that uh, if we want to have great things in our family, we have to be willing to sow great things into our family. If we want to have deep, rich relationships, we have to be willing to give into those relationships. If we want to see a return in any area of our life, we have to be willing to, to sacrifice for it, to give into it to look for that blessing. And so, Father, we do. We ask that uh, as we begin to consider those things, that you would open our understanding to places where we are cheap, where we give half of our attention, half of our effort, half of our heart, uh, in areas where it should be all of our attention, all of our effort, and all of our heart. And, Lord, bring that conviction that we don't continue to neglect the things that are so vital, those relationships, those circumstances that could truly be a blessing, reflect our heart for you and honor the kingdom and our families. Lord, give us the ability to own the areas where we have not measured up and to change it. In Jesus' name, amen. Well, guys, I just encourage you, take a look and make sure your life measures up. I'll see you tomorrow.